Hi guys, Scott here also on Scott2797 and welcome to, I think it's part 3 now, of my Pokemon Sword Let's Play. So, all I've done, basically, from where I left off, is I've left the house, I've ran behind it and, and found TM57 Payback, I think it is. Navigander. And I also got them, which I'll let you know about in a second. TM57 Payback, yes, which is a dark move. So I randomly found that behind the house. And I also got a Repel. So my Fishing Rod, Endorsement, Wishing Star, and a Dynamax Band. So I got the Quick Balls by because I've got the downloadable version. I've downloaded the game, when on Mystery Gift, types in the code that you get given. And you get 12 Quick Balls. I also have... A, if we look on the Pokedex, um, I've got a Sobble, well, Fort a Sobble, Flipbug, Fort, Fort, and it's going to be way, 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 way down here. Like, way, 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 way down here. Um, it was a mystery gift at the moment, so if you go on your mystery gift, you can get a Meowth. So, yeah, I have a Meowth, and it's, it says something about a Dynamax. So, yeah, I got that. So, at the moment, um, I, I found out that if I push the left analog stick in, it whistles. So, then I can whistle the animals towards me. I've already kicked your butt. And I'm going towards the train station. I don't want to fight that. I don't want to fight that. I don't want to fight that. I do want to fight something half decent. I'm not going to lie. You're cute. I will fight you. Oh... A Yamper. Okay. So I've been watching Randolph plays. I've been watching his playthrough so far. And he has caught a Yamper and called it Corgi Knight. Sort of like, apparently there's a Pokemon called Corva Knight. And just because it's a Corgi. And it is quite an original name, I'll be honest. It made me chuckle quite a bit. Um, scratch. I need to take my hoodie off as well. Because I've only just got in from work. Watched a Sidemen video with the 10,000 calorie challenge in America, which was quite a laugh. I do think Harry was lying, not going to lie. I don't think he quite nailed 10,000 calories. Either that, or I think what he's done is he's done it. He's just worn the same t shirt over the course of a few days because he was in Hawaii for the whole thing. And I think he's done that. Oh, why did I kill that? I actually wanted it. <laughs> So I'm not going to catch any Pokemon for now until I find one that's worth my while. I don't really want a Yamper. In fact, now I do, because a Yamper is an electric Pokemon, I think. I think it's an electric Pokemon anyway. Um, I did, I did, I have already caught um, a new Pokemon as well, which you'll be able to see when I've done, when I get out of this. Because I, I didn't know that there was another version of it. I think it must be. I think it's part of the Galer Galean or Galarian. I don't know. Um, I think it's an, an evol um, like similar to Alolan or Alolan. And you may have just seen the name then. Yamper's tail added some Pokedex. Yeah, generates electricity from the base of its tail. I hope it has. I'm not going to name him. I don't. I'll add him to my party and I will kick one out. So I'm going to kick out Gingy because Gingy is... Do I want to kick out Gingy? No, I'll kick out Zigzagoon. Because that is the Zigzagoon, that was, that's the Pokemon that I was talking about. So it has a black version. But no, I'm going to kick out Gingy because I've, I've, I've used Gingy in a fight so far. And let me tell you, absolutely shit. So if you look in the bottom left now, you can see that um, it comes with like a little trophy sort of thing. So, caught myself a Yamper. So, I was looking into this. So, the surprise trade is... Um, it is exactly what it is. It's, it's, it's Wonder Trade. So, the way that you do it, you connect to the internet with a plus button. Once you've connected, you can then go a Link Battle or Surprise Trade or Link Trade. So, I'm guessing Link Trade is back in, like, back in the old days where you used to... Oh, so you need a paid membership for that. Luckily, I'm not really going to do it anyway. But yeah, I can do that if I want to. 
because I'm not going to get a paid membership for Lizzie. Unless I do, I can give her it as a Christmas present because I'm just a nice person. Um, I don't want you, you pigeons. Flappy birds can get bent. There's nothing here. Back in Wedgehurst. Oh, what is this? And I found a revive. That is decent. That's actually worthwhile. Yes. I saw Hop sneaking off towards the station. Mega. Come on, Blaze. You'll never beat me to the station at that pace. I would if you would actually let me. But instead, you run ahead and there's me chilling in the top. Doing nothing. Right. Run, 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 run. I don't need anything from the shop at the moment because I've got everything I could possibly need. Can I get behind? Oh, never mind. How many did you catch? I caught a really special one. Oh. Sweet. Oh, nice. So you gave me Swift. I didn't really realize it was a Pokemon catching contest. But yeah, I'll have a second TM move. Teach move swiftly. Gave it to me ages ago and now it's yours. How? Oh, so motor stoke. And your train's waiting. Let's go. That's tight. Like your brother gave you swift and rather than use it. Because TM is going to be used once. Rather than use it. He just decided he wasn't and just left it. Not so fast, you two. Oh, Hop's fine-ass mama. What are you doing there, Mum? This day was coming since the moment you chose Sobble as your partner, darling. Professor Magnolia was kind enough to let us know that you two were setting out. So here, a last little gift to see you well on your way. All you need for camping. So a set of camping gear, that's nice. Everything you'd need to set up a tent and get cooking in the wild area or at a camping spot. Okay, no matter what happens out there, if you and your partner are together and you're fine, just think how lucky you are, mother. To the first ever pair of champion brothers come certain to the champion next. You'll see. <laughs> of course you will. Uh, of course. <clears throat> Loads of brilliant trainers and all kinds of Pokemon out there waiting for us. My excitement's running ahead of me. Come on, we are off. Absolute toe tapping good time, yeah. Motor Stoke is surrounded by a vast wild area. All sorts of wild Pokemon just wandering around. I've never seen those two Pokemon. Camp out, just bought a fish in. Don't think I could ever get tired of it. Why has he got a blue Pokedex? I want a blue Pokedex. That's time. Isn't this the wild area? What we stopped here for? Yes, this is the wild area station. Make no mistake. I'm sorry to tell you that the train is halted due to a flock of Wooloo on the tracks. That's quite weird. What to be sorry for? This is brilliant. Why is it brilliant? Oh, okay, so I get to actually go in the wild area now. Ooh. This is actually going to be quite cool. No, I don't sit down. So, let's go to the shop while I'm here. See what he, just to see what he's got. So I can get some more potions, which I have 13 of. I've got enough Pokeballs. I'll get myself some of these. Because I've got a lot of money at the moment. I've still got like 10 grand. So I might as well just get, spend two grand on each of these. I mean, because chances are I'll never use them. I usually just, I'm that sort of guy who, because I want at least 10 of each. I'm the sort of guy that if he's sleeping, if the, if the Pokemon's sleeping, I'll just carry on fighting until I get it. Oh, so that's how you change station. Okay. Find your way through the wild area to reach Moto Stoke next. It's nice that they have like a little objectives in the top left along with your cutscenes. Right. So I'm going to be right back for two seconds because I am actually going to be nice to Lizzie. Okay, so I was going to be nice to Lizzie, but I do not know her password. So therefore, Lizzie does not get a surprise. So I'm just double checking here just to see if there's anything in here. There isn't, so I'm going to the wild area. Look at that. I'm guessing that is the town ahead. That looks quite cool, that. 
high rise skyscraper crane motor stone way off that way between there and here are countless new pokemon waiting to be met oh hello and if it isn't son what are you doing here my grand gave me pr proper earthful in her own way those two young trainers are setting off on a journey what do you do in your life wow <laughs> About <laughs> about that Pokemon you two met in the forest. I'm gonna try and work out what it is. Maybe even Grand admit I've got some talent. Being an adult has got its own challenges, eh? I said you needn't worry about it. I'm glad to be on the road, really. It's been ages. It'll be great fun to fish and camp and rip outside again. I'm off to go stick my head in as many of those red glowing dens as I can find. I'm gonna battle a snap, a bunch of Dynamax Pokemon, and fill in another page in my tale of my legend. What cheat? Dynamax Pokemon are really on another level, you know. You'd better Dynamax your partner Pokemon too if you want to take on the opponents that strong. You'll find spots here and there in the wild area that emit a red beam of light. If you think you're up for it, check them out. There'll be a Dynamax Pokemon lurking inside. So with that, how about I send you off a little treat from me? A box link. A device that allows you to access Pokemon storage system. Ah, that's good. So rather than me having to go through... So I can do that by... Selecting Pokemon from the X menu and pressing the R button. That's better. Rather than me having to mess around the whole time, having to run back to Pokemon Centers, I can just go into my box. Waiting for you, this is the start of your real adventure. <coughs> wow. It does actually look okay. It looks a bit bare bones. There's not much grass. I didn't. There was a red light there. Okay. Can we sold at low prices? So that. Okay. Wow. There's tons to pick up. So that is a gigantic onyx. And I think. The large Pokemon you see wandering around in the wild area are strong. If you try battling one and it seems like you're running over your head, try to run. Run like the wind. So the large Pokemon like those are the hard ones. Looking at your cam, even the PP, they need to use their moves you know, over and over again. Okay. So that's what the camp's for. Yes, I will shake it. Cherry berry and an orange berry. Shake it more. Cherry berry. Orange berry. One more. Quit. I'll have six. I'll have the six berries. Three cherry berries, two orange, and a peach berry. That's actually pretty cool. That. So what can I see? Like what Pokemon can I see from there? There's the B ones. I think they're called Combi. Is that a Tyrogue? Oh, decent. So if I remember correctly, Tyrogue is the one that evolves into Hitmonlee, Hitmonchan, and Hitmontop. Level seven. I could. I can have that one. I'm not gonna throw a great ball, but yeah. <clears throat> Fighting type Pokemon would be okay for the team. Wow. Helping hand, but it failed. I'm just gonna go straight in with another Pokeball. Should be able to catch a level seven. Jeez. One, two. You having a laugh? Uh, just to speed it up, um, fight. Uh, I go scratch. Fake out, but it failed. You're a failure at life, Tyrog. No, because I just I, I want. I, hmm, it's just a tough one. I don't want to kill any. I want to just like. Def Are you high? I don't want to have to dis like beat any Pokemon. If I don't need to, because I don't really want to just spend the whole time fighting Pokemon. And I do semi just want a decent team. I want ideally a few different types, like one or one of one of a few different types. So I've got my grass Pokemon with Tommy, flying with Flappy Bird, electric with Yamper, um, water with Stanley. So I think I'm going to get rid of my Zigzagoon for Tyrogue. Because I only really... Tyrogue didn't name... No, not for now. I need Lizzie to... um. 
I need Lizzie to start naming Pokemon because I can't do it. Because I remember Zigzagoon being an absolute shocking Pokemon, but apparently also they are uh, they have um. Apparently they brought in a new evolution for it, and it looks amazing. So the only reason I'm fighting this is just so I can get it for Pokedex. Um, I'll scratch it. I'll just use another scratch, and hopefully it survives. If it does, I'm going to catch it. Struggle bug. Oh, okay. Special attack. Luckily, my Pokemon's not a special attacker. Because I did, I did a tiny bit of research, and he's not a special attacker in the slightest. Three. Okay, so I caught that. So that is another one to my collection. I'm not going to have it in my team, because I think it's just a bug Pokemon. But Tommy's now 13. So that is always a good thing. Fluffy Bird's 11. Yampa's 6. And Lizzie is 9. I just want Lizzie to evolve. I want them all to evolve, really. Yeah, bug flying. That's it's pathetic. So it's been sent to the box. Um, anything else that I can want? No, not, not one of them. Um, so let's run around and just see if I can see anything decent. So these are where the Dynamax raids are. So if there's a pillar of red light, 50W, what's the W? <clears throat> So if I press that, I can see a wider view. There's a rabbit there that I've never seen before. Bunnelby. Fair enough. I'm going to catch it just so I have it. And that is all I want. Oh, level 10. This one's a big boy. This might be a tough fight. I lied. Leah, that's pointless. You ain't going to do she. Pokeball. One, two, three. Cop. Nice. I've got some. I'm, I'm doing bits today. I've actually caught some like a fair few decent Pokemon. Because level ten, I got quite a bit of XP for it all as well. Bone all this data. Sweet. I will not have anything. I will send it straight to my box. Oh, no way. It's my first Dynamax raid. Oh. That's a good shout. I will see if I can... Let's see what level this is. <coughs> 15. Mega Drain. Oh, this is going to be... Not that bad. Not that bad at all. It's going to be a long draining battle this though. If he lies, I'm going to die. Pokemon. Flappy Bird is level 11. See, I, I only have... Like, water's not going to do anything against the grass. I need a fire Pokemon. <clears throat> I think I might end up running. I don't want to. That's a hefty bit you've just drained. You've just got back as well. Um, power trip. Oh, no. Right, power trip. That was horrendous. That was a joke. Um, bag. No, I want to... Um, Pokemon. Yes, use that. 
because he's he's gonna get wiped out now. <sighs> but I'm not bothered. Flappy Bird is tough. Come on, use next Pokemon. Tommy, come back out, mate. We need you. Right. Um, Scratch is the best move I can use on it. Use on a. Magical Leaves does damage, though. Do I reckon I can beat... I can catch her, actually. Because if I can catch her, that's a, that's a whole other ball pack. And I do have a great ball. Could be a massive waste of a great ball. Not bothered though. I got a level 15 and it actually evolves Rose Elliot into a Roserade. Right, so now I've got a better grass Pokemon as well. Yeah, Flappy Bird's gonna. What? <laughs> Flappy Bird is going. <laughs> they leveled up. What the hell? Absolute bits. That was way worth my time. And I caught it. Yes! Oh, I'm buzzing with that. Add to my party, yeah. You're going, Flappy Bird. You are goners. Right, so I'm going to set up camp just in front of this. So, Pokemon camp. So you can make food here that can actually like it can like revive Pokemon, revive PP and stuff. In your Pokemon camp, you and your Pokemon can play together and even eat together, growing closer for your experience. If your Pokemon grow very close to you, they may even try extra hard for you during battle. You can play using your Joy-Con too. If you slide your Joy-Con off your system, you can wave one. Uh, wave one about to throw a ball. People Pokemon to retreat. That's cute. While there, you'll be able to play with up to three other trainers at a time. That's actually pretty cool. So is it just the six that I have? Yes, it is. So, menu. Cook him. Okay. I'm going to cook up a fine curry. Start cooking. <coughs> so you can only use berries. So I'm going to use three, three, four. Okay. They're in. So I press A to fan the flames. There we go. Does this want to get any hotter? So get a good stirring. It's like cooking mama all over again, this. I used to love that game back on the DS. I didn't get it on 3DS, though. I, I, at that point, I was a bit too old for it. And then you get me now doing it again. Okay, so... <clears throat> I don't know if that was good or not. Done. Everyone's absolutely buzzing. Spicy curry. Ooh. <laughs> Look at Gooka there. It's like, ah. Oh. He wants a bit. Wob effect class. And you gained XP points for it. That's pretty cool. So. Change. Right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take down my tent now. <laughs> A little baby points. That's not too bad, that. Right. So now, you're still poisoned. Um, paralysis. Petra Berry is poisoning. Yes. Oran Berry is that. Right. This is going to be big. Gained 300W. Defeat down next Pokemon and you get a chance at catching it. Additionally, there are some rare items that you can only obtain by battling down next Pokemon. So that is that a trap inch? 
I've invited others. I don't know what's happening though. But I'm ready whenever. I'll do the whole three minutes, but I won't let you watch it because that's pointless. Oh my god, oh, dynamite. So I can actually do it. Yes, lad. Dynamite's the shit out of you. What? That's hectic. Yes, that was loud as anything as well. I'm bigger than you. Not bothered. I don't know what overgrowth did. I'll tell you what it did. Decimated. I really want to catch it though, I'm not going to lie. Oh, nah. Dazzling gleam. Oh, you killed it. Oh, no, yeah, throw a Pokeball now. Yeah, I want to catch that. I know what a trap inch evolves into. I think. I'm sure it evolves into Flygon. Go on. One. Two. Come on, guys. Three. Yep. Absolute smashed it. Yes. Trap inch was caught. I'm buzzing with that. Not gonna lie. And I got loads. XP candies, dynamite's candy, wiki berries, dragon dragon claw. And a big nugget. They're worth dough. Nuggets usually worth like a grand or something, so I'm not too sure what that's gonna be worth. I can't remember what trap inch evolves into. Yeah, I'll add you to my party. I don't know what level you are, but I know what's going. Um, Stanley. Stanley can go. I'm sorry, Stanley. That's hype. Like, what's tra does it Can you find out what trap inch evolves into on this? Check summary. Let's have a gander at this, what the Dynamax levels are. What is the Dynamax level mean then? Because he's level 2 and that sounds better. Oh my god. I'm going to actually leave it there for today, guys. So if you have enjoyed, because I've... Ooh, another Dynamax down there. No, no, it's not. I'm sidetracking. I'll face the wall so I don't get side, dis um, distracted. So yeah, thanks for watching, guys. If you haven't, if you have enjoyed watching it, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more Pokemon content. I am smashing this game at the moment, and if you allow me, I will catch as many Pokemon as I possibly can, even if you want to watch it. So let me know in the comments below if you don't mind me catching Pokemon. If you do mind me catching them, let me know as well. I'll see what I can do about that, and I'll try and just skip the battles if I can. So leave it there anyway, guys. Hope you've enjoyed. If you have, peace out. Bye.